Now, detectives in West Valley investigating a report of a murder and a body hidden in the area. The, they believe that the man that they have behind bars killed one woman and held another hostage for weeks, torturing her the entire time. Ariel Harrison is live in the West Valley, and Ariel, the details of this story are just so disturbing. Incredibly disturbing, which we'll get to in just a moment. But first, we're in the area of 3360 South on Greenmont Drive. This is the house that's at the center of the investigation. You can see behind me the police tape up as their investigation continues. They have the garage door open. You can see inside quite the messy situation in there with windows that are open as police continue to comb through evidence surrounding this case. Now, detectives say that the victim of the kidnapping says that the suspect involved killed another person and she watched him do it. So the suspect is now behind bars uh, for charges related to all of this. That's 50 year old Garmin Cunningham. Now initially reports came into police that Cunningham had a gun. When teams got to the scene here at the home, a standoff led to Cunningham coming out of the home with a sword after firing a shot at officers. Now police used less lethal force when he came out of the home. He took off running after dropping a sword. A canine caught up to him and stopped him and that's when police took him into custody. Now according to court documents, Cunningham held a female victim against her will for nearly two weeks. He physically and sexually abused her over that time, cutting her with glass and forcing her to drink WD-40. That is according to court documents from police. Now, the suspect does have previous charges that make it illegal for him to have a gun in the first place. Coming back out here for an additional live look again at the scene as police continue to investigate. Uh, we uh, do know that police are looking into allegations, as we mentioned, uh, that this man allegedly killed another woman in addition to holding this other woman hostage and torturing her. That's something they continue to look into, and that's why they're still here on scene, potentially looking for a body. We'll provide updates as we get them, of course. But for now, reporting live in West Valley City, I'm Arielle Harrison, KUTV 2 News. Back to you.